This is the first time I've seen an alligator here at Metro, and I've been here since 99. This baby American alligator is about three feet long, but don't be fooled. Officials say it's actually stronger than it looks. Pull right through those. Experts at Metro Animal Services in Casper say they paid a visit to the man's house to recover the reptile, and when they got there, they found it just laying in a big horse trough in one of the rooms, and the dad was not happy. I don't think he was even aware that his son had the alligator in his yeah. possession. Metro officials say the man's son bought the exotic reptile from an online website and had it shipped here from Arizona. So they've been taking care of it for the past week, but what do you feed a baby alligator? A hamburger, a chicken, just cook it like you normally wouldn't and feed it chunks of meat. One neighbor says she remembers seeing Metro Animal Services in the neighborhood recently, but didn't know why they were there. Metro's been patrolling the area and I just assumed it was a, a dog yeah. that got loose. And when I told her what it actually was... It was a baby alligator. It was like three feet long. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> In Florida, yes. Wyoming, no. No, 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 no. Sorry, I'm not happy. So what's next for the baby alligator? We're going to ship him to the Phoenix Herp Herp Society um, sometime next week. And the next time you want to buy an exotic animal online, officials say you should do your homework first. So when you're buying an animal, a pet animal, consider how long lived the species is and how big it gets um, because you could end up with a 25-year-old turtle or a very large alligator on your hands. Tony Cedrone, News 13, Casper.